in the shed here now and that's the beer hide you're drying and uh, I got the this is one of the paths from the beer and I'm gonna prep this one to cook uh, you know some people consider the beer pie a real delicacy uh, I never tried them before but I'm kind of looking forward to it because uh, you know I'm a big fan of seal flipper and for some reason I would say it's kind of similar to that uh, you know I may cook it up and I may not even like it I don't know but uh, I think I will uh, the way I've been told to cook it is uh, you end joint every bone again joint every little part and uh, you just boil it in salted water so uh, so I'm adventurous I'm going to give it a try and uh, we'll see how it goes all right, so I'm going to sit and joint this up here now, every little piece, so a little slippery. <laughs> All right, so here's the start of it. Yep, one more. Actually, you know, I was saying now this is going to be kind of rich. I don't know if I'll be able to eat a whole lot of it. really nice you know yeah they do bit by bit. I'm gonna be uh, uh, quite honest you know that uh, pa on the cardboard didn't look the best starting off but now that I got it all jointed up and washed man that looks really good uh, if someone would hand me over this bone and told me to take a look I would, I would say we get a porcupine too it really reminds me of porcupine the look of it uh, yeah I was kind of skeptical but I'm really looking forward to trying this now Water's almost boiling now, so I'm just gonna add some salt to the water. So just salted water. Clean off the 
the lens <laughs> and uh, yeah so I'm just going to add uh, the bits and pieces of the polar bear pie to this boiling water Lens is steaming up there. And now uh, I'm going to bring it to a boil. And when it comes to a boil, I'm going to start my time. And I was told to boil for uh, at least 45 minutes, but I'm going to boil for, give it an extra 15 and boil for a full hour. And uh, yeah, when the hour is up, we'll take it out and have a look at it and give it a little taste test. All right, it's boiling here now, so uh, I'm going to turn the heat back a little bit and mark the time, and I'm going to let this cook now for uh, a full hour. All right, I had it uh, boiling there for an hour. Turn off the stove there now, and first thing I do is a little smell test. <laughs> Gee, smells all right. Smells good. Good. Steamed up there a bit, but now let's plate this up. <laughs> Looks a little tough. I don't know. I'm gonna put a few pieces. Do not need all that. Try that much first. <laughs> well, it looks good. It smells good. And that's right now. Only one thing to do. Show you one piece? Jeez. Looking good. I'm trying to think what it tastes like. I'm like eating a wing. <laughs> Much better than I thought. Oh yeah. Trying to take a look. You are good. Any at all around with that. Mm. You know, sometimes you try something new, it don't work out, and sometimes it works out. Yeah, this is a hit. I know other people gonna try this as well. I give it a, a full hour. I think you can cook it 45 minutes, but I did give it the full hour. Just be safe, huh? I know a lot of people, you don't want to get a chance to try this with a polar bear pie, but uh, if you get a chance, try it with a black bear pie. It should be much the same. God, I feel stronger already. I'm really surprised. That is really, 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 really good. Rich though, I tell ya. Oh, 
Well, anyway, guys, uh, I guess that'll be it for this video, though. Uh, you know, uh, like I said, I just wanted to give them a try, and they turned out surprisingly good. First time having them, it won't be the last. Anyway, I really appreciate y'all watching, and uh, hope she's all on the next one. All the best from the big land.